Hello everyone, welcome to part four of my Neverware project. Uh, since part three, uh, the producers of the game have uh, released a patch uh, that f apparently fixes a few bugs, but also apparently creates some massive bugs on the likes of Windows, which uh, Meet, which has led to them clawing back the patch almost immediately. Uh, which uh, obviously is uh, uh, well, it's good service on their part since it impacted so many. But they have made the 1.0.7 uh, release uh, available as a beta, and I have chosen to run it. I'm running on Linux. Uh, which uh, uh, which uh, 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 means that I probably benefit more, more from the uh, patches. So uh, so far so good. Uh, I've also removed the autosave mod uh, because I had a weird crash from it, and uh, it would cause random. Uh, stalls in the uh, uh, game operation. So anyway, the reason I'm downgrading these roads here is what I thought might help with the traffic actually didn't. So I, I've just put it back. So I'm going to move the parks up to the roads. I'm going to leave the extant roads here, uh, mostly because uh, I don't see any reason to remove them. But now that I've done all of this, I need to um, rezone the extra space from the road shrinking. Uh, so I'll do that. Now my researches have suggested that uh, the best way to avoid abandonment in this type of development is to go ahead and uh, create a uh, uh, city services, which uh, which the uh, development will like. Now it turns out the services that they want are pretty much everything, including um, fire. Police, and uh, strangely enough, health. Um, well, maybe not so strange, but But anyway, um, and by putting these in there and making sure trash is dealt with and all of that, um, I act actually improved my overall um, uh, desirability and therefore the uh, areas will level up. Um, now while I'm at this renovation here, I'm going to extend this some more. Uh, and then I'm going to remove the industrial area on the other side of the highway. Uh, 
Okay. Now I'm also going to bring this over this way and into here. Now I'm not building a bigger road here because ultimately I'm going to put a uh, cargo um, train loop up there. Um, and the bigger road will just create traffic bottlenecks. So uh, just due to the traffic control. So if I just skip putting it there in the first place, I can avoid some level of pain. Uh, okay, and I was zoning this as industrial. Okay. Uh, yeah. Good. Right. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, so I've uh, added some industrial there. Uh, and what I'm going to do is dezone this stuff here. Um, and that uh, pretty much, uh, I'm also going to rejigger the roads in here. Um, and uh, rejigger the roads completely. Because ultimately, I'm going to turn this into residential. Okay. I'm going to get rid of the obsolete services here. Okay. And I'm going to uh, replace the services with the ones that people here are going to want. And uh, okay, I need to start the simulation up again uh, as I've run out of money. Now I'm going to have something of a traffic bottleneck here for uh, a while. Uh, until I can actually build a freight station here. But while I'm waiting for my population to get high enough to do that, I'm going to build an overpass here. The idea here is that it will ultimately take some strain off the other one. Okay. the direction of the off-ramps to the right way. And uh, I need to also uh, bring a road around from here and Okay, good. Um, what I'm going to do is in this area, I'm going to set up a 
commercial district. And I'll also, whoops, not quite right. Come up one slot there. And I'll bring this road across. Okay, now to plumb it, and I need to sort out some electricity. I see uh, this doesn't connect. Okay, now it does. Okay. Uh, finish connecting the water. Okay. Oops, I need to go the other way because of how long my blocks are. Whoops. Uh, yes, I'll have to come across here. And I'll have to also come across here. And across here. Good. Now, I'm going to go for dense commercial here. I guess I'll go along like this too. I'm also going to need power. So I'll bring the power across this way. Um, I suppose I can bring some across this way too. gets power in there. Now, for buses in this area, I'm going to add another loop here and bring this loop across. Speaking of buses, 
I need to make a bus line around here. And while I'm at it, I'll extend this line up around here. And here. And here. No, here. and here and here okay that should uh, link things up there nicely uh, should get the uh, traffic coming through here uh, more effectively um, now over here is going to be uh, residential once I have enough cash to build the services so I'll speed everything up and uh, let things tick along briefly here Okay, so as you can see, the traffic here does fairly well uh, as long as you don't have the traffic lights at every intersection. Now I'm going to have a fair amount of truck traffic back and forth here as the industrial delivers to commercial. Um, I should be able to reduce that, at least some of the pressure here, uh, when I have freight trains. Sixty K for a fire station and sixty K for that. What do I need? Okay, I don't need near so much for those. Okay. Okay, so far so good. See the demographics here. Whoops, that's not that's the demographics. Unemployment's up at fifteen percent.
I'm going to slow that back down and look at my bus routes again here. Ooh, I made it to small city, so now I can build my train stations. Um, okay, so what I'm going to do is build a loop line around here. For when um, Hold up. No, 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 no. That's not what I want to do. I want to come across this way and stop there and come back around this way. That way, I connect up with the metro station. Right, that's what I want to do there. Ah, now I can afford my bigger services here. Okay. And... Uh, let's gazelle along a bit here. Okay, now there's my last uh, big service there, and now I will zone it. There we go. Fancy new area. Now, I'm also going to put offices in back here. Uh, okay, so I've got a bit of a traffic bottleneck there, but uh, I'll be able to sort that out. I'm going to want a university as well, but uh, I can't afford that yet. Uh, how's... Uh, okay, next I'm going to need to uh, install some power capacity.
And my population is growing fairly quickly right now too. That's useful. build one more of these and then I'll wander off and look at some other stuff here okay uh, over here Okay, so I'm going to need to build the uh, big services over here too. Uh, now I've gone fairly low on cash, so what I'm going to do is go over here in the uh, budget. I'm going to go under loans. Well, I don't really have a useful loan size in there, so I'm not going to take it. Um, anyway. Uh, what I ultimately want to do is build the big services over here as well. But what I am going to do is set up for uh, my train stations. here. I can't build one just yet. But I can get the services in uh, at both sites here. Okay. Now, if I go back in here, I'll speed it up a bit to get the uh, cash in. Again, these are quite expensive. So, now you can see the fairly heavy traffic I have developing here. Um, there's a fair bit of traffic on the highways coming in this way as well. Uh, so what will happen is once I've built the train stuff, I'll run a train line down the middle along parallel to the highway here, all the way down to the train connection down here, where I'll put in a pair of uh, cargo stations to interchange cargo so that the main line here uh, doesn't end up uh, sending a bunch of half-filled trains into the city and it should keep the train congestion to a minimum uh, the other thing I'm gonna have to do here is provide power now I think that'll be enough to do it and I think it'll be enough to do it that this way here. I'll uh, see ah water's iffy okay I better uh, I better go stash another pumping station over here and uh, oh that linked good 
and I clearly need another outflow pipe as well. Um, okay, and that I'll need to link. Uh, now, let's see, okay, electricity still connects, so I don't need to worry there. Okay, electricity's still good. Not enough customers. That's probably due to traffic. Okay. So, I'll build a cargo terminal here. And, uh, power it. Now I'm going to need to run run a track across. Okay. I'm going to slow this down, turn this off, actually I'll uh, go straight here. not going to work. Okay. That's where I need to start on the curvy stuff. Okay. Okay, now I'm, I'm bringing the rail down. I'm going to try to avoid going over the highway, but there, there's a couple of spots where that won't be terribly practical.
Now I've kept it elevated here. So that I can go over obstacles. But now I can drop to ground level and head down this way Okay. Now, down here, I need to build a loop. This loop will have two cargo stations on it. but I'll power it once I build the stations. Okay. Uh, there'll be one station linked to this and the other will link to this. Okay. So head back up here. collect some more uh, people and some cash. I need about 180 to uh, do what I want to do. See how's trash over here? Yeah, it seems okay. It'll be less okay if this traffic bottles up. But so far it seems okay. You know, things are bottled up over here. some offices here. Okay, so if I head down here, I can build the external station now. And uh, link that up. I don't need Y connectors here because the trains can uh, switch direction at the stations. OK. 
Okay, I'll bring power down there that way. Now it wants water too. And I'll bring it up the uh, highway right of way here. Yeah, mostly because of my OCD on this sort of thing. And there we go. Now. Okay, so I need some ramps here. correct direction okay and I need a ramp to go up and over the hell Why can't you upgrade? Okay, excellent. Now, uh, right. Uh, 
Okay. Um, now, if I stash an incinerator down here, I can clear up any trash that appears. Now, ooh, big city, crematorium. I'm going to have to uh, do something with that, but first... I am going to Now, here's the fun thing we can do. Even though we can't build this on uh, an on-ramp, they will connect to one. possibly do something clever there. You know what? No. Uh, I'll go back to this. Okay, so question is, it enters there, so that side's sane. What the hell? Weird. Okay. So I have a traffic interchange going here. And that's a full load. Okay, and that arrives in the industrial area, and then it gets full and heads back. Excellent. I should name these terminals. And I need to put one over here to complete everything, so I'm going to do that. Okay. Okay. And make sure the power reaches okay uh, 
Um, I also have some power issues here. Okay. So far, so good. to do here is and here as well okay Okay, so let's see here. Crematorium. This is the sort of thing people like. So if I build them, Okay, what I'm going to do when I have the cash, I think, yeah, because I don't have the cash right now. Is stick an incinerator over here. I also need some cash to build some uh, additional uh, services over here. Although, I can stash a park in, and if I put another one over here, and I don't know, Stick one here. I know, I'll stick one here.
Okay, so that's a bunch of parks. That should make people happier. And we'll have an incinerator over here. Okay, so based on that, Okay. Okay, something I might be able to do here to improve things is upgrade that little bit of road. this little bit of road. Uh, all my bus lines are somewhat effective, so that's good. Yeah, that's so much better now that Escape with the 1.07 uh, version no longer needs to uh, always bring up the pause menu um, when the infos are open. Now that it uh, allows those to uh, close. Okay, so based on that, I'm going to I'll first take a look in here, uh, 18,000, that's the current one, 22 is the next one, okay. So I'm going to call that the end of part four. Okay, everyone, that's it for part four of the Neverwhere project. Um, I'll see everybody next time in part five. Thank you for watching.